The following video provides snippets from a recent STEM workshop I conducted for secondary teachers. Teachers are given the engineering design challenge to design, build, and test a simple prototype prosthetic hand that has the ability to lift up a paper cup with mask. The challenge is inquiry-based and incorporates the engineering design process. Teachers are first given models of the human hand to study prior to brainstorming and selecting materials to build the models. At the end of the design challenge, each group demos their models and shares the processes they went through, including design improvements. I've also used this challenge in Next Generation Science Standards Professional Staff Development Workshops as well. Okay, that will work. So, yeah, same idea. Came up with the original idea here, and then as a group we decided it wasn't, it was sort of working, but because when it would pull on it, it would like go different directions. It, it bent the opposite of where I expected it. So we put the string, the knot on the, on the same side as the joints, and then we notched out these joints, and now it works much better. Because I was expecting it to go That's this way. That's the big difference, though. Yeah. Pull them together. We put little holes and tie them together with the wire. Probably like, um, you know, shorter, longer. That would, I don't think we want them all the same distance. Yeah. Let's see which of all of our parts together. There needs to be something that goes from here or like something on this side that pulls it together. So if we're holding it from here, there needs to be that string or something that. Good. That should be so much. Sixteen. <laughs> Six, yeah. I'd say it's like number maybe like seven. Okay. So now we haven't explored now how it goes together yet. That's our next process is how to get the, the thumb opposable. Um, and then what kind of material we'll use for here and what kind we'll... <laughs> We Maybe. can drink water out of it. Yeah. Okay, so these here. <laughs> and then I go, we'll go over it. Easy <laughs> piecing. Easy. Back up on there. I can. <laughs> I think that's well, we can say that this guy worked in a sawmill and he lost a thumb. <laughs> and he didn't have one. Is well, that? I think that's too far down for the fingers to end. Well, that's not perfect. <laughs> so I tried to make something that modeled tendons, and uh, when we approached the project, they were still brainstorming some stuff, and I just thought, all right, I gotta test this out, you know, because because the rest of my idea hinged on that, and it worked out, and we went from there, made multiple fingers, and then put it into a frame. About 100 grams of uh, gravel or whatever into this cup, put a good grip on it, and we uh, job. So it just, we tried, it just like him going in different directions, so. Um, and we didn't have, because our fingers weren't long enough, so we added some flexible tubing in. Really uh, getting one going and figuring out what we wanted, and then we mass produced that with five fingers. I was cutting the tubing, and she was doing the string thing. And I did the she arteries and veins. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. You guys lifted a cup. Ooh. the glove on it totally doesn't look like a hand and um, so that's an issue also we didn't really attach the foam to this so maybe right. we would do something like that um, also the pulley system we would do a little bit different so that maybe have two connected like the other one did so that they could go together and I think also when you how that bounce back they don't really do that so we really need to figure out how to I think Key was trying to get the joints to move like we got. This one moves pretty well, but making it stiff enough so that it comes back and forth. So we kind of just let this one be where it is. And I. Yay! 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 Yay!
started with straw, then we went with tubing on the outside and that wasn't quite right so we added more tubing in a different location and duct tape. Eventually we came up with a finger that we liked but we could have done but maybe maybe for a eight R. Well, that